LED light. So just got those bits here to do. And a bit along there, but we'll just replace, sort some of those noggins out. And then do that. We've got the cable rolled up to go along into the next phase when it happens. Um, but yeah, we've got all the OSB on. And we've just got this super holes patch up here. And then we can get on to uh, putting the plasterboard on, hopefully. Got all the cables marked out where all the cables are. Sadly, I didn't realise that I should have probably um, had that slightly lowered down for the wall unit. Um, but never mind, we'll just have to, we're going to measure them all out. And then once the passport's up, we can go up with pencil, mark them all out again, and then do it that way. So uh, that's the plan anyway. But uh, yeah, we're getting there slowly. But as you can see, we have plasterboard on right up till we get to about there. So we've got all the cables here to connect in. So you've got your two cooker, your cooker hub, six mil cables fed. We don't have the breakers in any of that yet, um, but that is hopefully going to get completely replaced. I say completely, it could just be the, because um, we've noticed that on that section there, there's no RCD on that section. So from one, two, three, four. Five, the first five is only connected onto that. So we may end up connecting an RCD in there and have a nap text as well, which seems a bit odd. I don't know if there's a specific reason why they do that, but get another RCD and we'll be sorted. Um, but we've got all the things marked out. We have got it all, a drawing measured out um, somewhere in here. I'm not sure where. There you go. So in here we've got all the measurements of the um, where all the studs are, the cables are. Um, sorry. So we've got a oven feed, oven switch, dishwasher switch, dishwasher supply, um, cooker hob switch, hob supply. So what we're going to do is put boxes on here and then have another cable feed up. So if you ever need a replacement can, that'll just be a normal double socket. The reason why we haven't put a double socket over in this section is because the cooker one we're putting in here is going to have a plug socket onto it. Then we've got our three sockets along there, um, so we're sorted on that side. We've got all the plasterboard all on, ready to plaster, um, and we're not plastering really that much as such. We'll plaster that piece, but that joint won't be plastered because then we're going to go way on to that side of the the house for the next part so uh, so yeah we're, we're sort of getting there I do apologize it's not been many videos um, but I have been flat out here I'm stuck on time I've only got really until the end of September and then we're back on the farm doing stuff next week we're going to be on the farm so this week I'm in town next week we'll be on the farm doing jobs so it'll be more farm related stuff um, it is but uh, like I said this is all part of me getting to the farm is doing this house up um, to support the family while I'm not around so for the summer season um, and then we've got all the units and all that to fit in there we'll see how it goes um, but yeah don't forget to give us a thumbs up don't forget to comment and uh, let us know what you think um, hopefully you you think I've done a good job mm -hmm.